hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys is doing absolutely great today i want to share with you how to make this baby salon flyer design into this let's check the intro Decography skills with creativity please consider subscribing to our youtube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos so without wasting much of our time guys let's dive into today's tutorial yeah good day guys welcome back to the Decography design training hope you guys are doing absolutely great so as I said, right now I'm going to show you how to make a baby salon salon flyer on your handwriting right smartphone using your PC lab. So without wasting much of our time, let's get started. The first thing is to determine our background size. So I want to use this particular background size, which is 120 by 120. After that, we are going to select the kind of background color we want. So I want to use this black background color. So you go to your shape and you have your shape and radius to be something like 13 or 14. Have it increased a little bit exactly like this. Then you position and leave it here. But make sure you do a justification by positioning to the center. Now go back. Sorry, go back to your gallery and import this particular element or this element one after the other. So we'll move this and scale it like this. After that, we have it work and we are going to adjust this a little bit. We are going to adjust it a little bit. We will make sure that it comes down a bit. Then we reposition it to the center to look exactly like this. We'll go to back to our gallery and import the second one then we have it positioned very well exactly like this so we have it locked too. so i'm getting there then the next thing we're going to do is to position everything exactly like this so we'll have this being coming down a bit then after that we are going to lock it as well so the next thing we are going to do is to go with our right hand. Then we have splashing. We have this being delicate, deleted. We have splashing. You can see splashing. So we have a solution, then we are going to change our font, change our font to this, very tiny, then we have this, we have solution, I'm thinking we will use another font differently, like uh, we can use a uh, I use this Matizera font. Matizera font will be better. We will have this solution in this. And then on position this here, we will have another one being copied. Where we have here cut. Then we are going to change the font. I will go to Matizera board. Then that will be increased a bit and it's going to be positioned here. So after this has been done, we need to adjust this and making it go up so that we can 
have space to position this so after that this we are going to come here then we put justification by alignment and we are going to bring this one here then the next thing we are going to do after position that uh, we are going to be shaped then we have our radius to be something like that and then we are going to increase the size let it be 15 then we are going to i think it's okay with 30 and let's see 25 and we have it we are going to position it here So you can see so we'll bring it down good we'll go to the color and apply yellow color very good then you put justification have it lock immediately so after that we are going to know what actually remain because we are going to tap from here and wow the address floor two as you can see southwest southwest and bathroom states So we we'll have this as an address, position to the center. Don't forget to hit the subscribe say, button and the bell icon. Then position it here. I will position here. Then we have the phone number. The phone number is the Then we will have that position here. We can make it this to be in a straight line since it's just like that. Then we position it here, which you can see. Then we are going to increase a bit to something like 23. This one, the same thing to 23. So we go back to our gallery and we have all the social media icon imported then we have them lock so we need to position this here we have this reduced So have this position very well. Like this, then we have it locked. So move this one towards it. You can lock it as well. We need to be able to shift. Shift this. So this is cool. The next thing you are going to do is to lock this. Then you have this position work. You lock it as well. Then have the number in position right too. Make sure they are aligned. 
turn on the align button on the icon so you can see so we can adjust this a bit very good so you can see it then you can see it add this reposition move this towards edge and then you can now merge the two the four together tap on this and centralize to the center very good so the next thing we are going to do we tap on this want to detach want to detach this I want to detach it so we'll come to the mask and have it detach we enable copy and paste and how to sorry so this is going to be exactly here now that we have that we have shape which we are going to put at the center here and then we have a crop give it a color and we are going to bring it down here so we are going to cut that so we have something like this reduce is that like this tap on it and click on here so we tap open then you can see the results. don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the now bell icon when we are going to change the color to this so the next one is this we are coming here to go to our texture area where we go to our photo we need to go to photos where we have this and we are going to position this you can see very good so now the next thing is we go to the stroke we apply like four stroke to make it awesome. Good. So we have the cleaver. We are going to reduce the opacity to something like 25. Very good, sorry. We'll go to the second, which is brush. We are going to opacity reduce to 25 as well which is plum after that we are pretty finishing touch to that we are going to our gallery so we'll go to what's our document we are going to attach some icon so we need some icon there, which need to be attached So, so I've seen one. Sorry. So we have what we do this. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon. And then need to be position here. We are positioned that here. Position it here. We have another one, the 
color should be white. We have another one being position here. We change the color to this to white. Good. Now I'm going to merge the two and copy. So we have it copy. Then we are bringing it down here. So I'm going to 3D change it to fill that direction. Reduce the size. Come here and reduce the size. Very good. So now the next thing is we need the plus sign. I mean multiplication sign on this type OK. Then we are bringing that one to come here. So that is OK. So now we've put the finishing touch in everything. The next thing we are going to do, we are going to just put it and leave it like that. And this is just exactly how you can uh, make a salon flyer on your Android smartphone using your PC lab. Thanks for watching. Have you saved? Dimension should be ultra. Why your format should be PNG? Thanks for watching. God bless you.